Hello everybody, my name is Kanger Poseidon, also known as KP Games. And welcome to Override... Well, the original. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that. But all these characters are returning in the second game. Right. So I decided to go back. And play as the only character who is not Mirai. <laughs> I did this recording before, somewhat. I decided, no one wants too easy. I'll go hard. And I'll just use, um... Any mod skills I unlock. I'll upgrade myself, etc, etc. You know. We get the whole point. I want to make this tough for myself. I don't want this to be a cakewalk, so I decided to go back. I want you guys to be entertained. <laughs> so entertain, to be entertained through my suffering. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, this guy's the only person who's not come back. I did that, um... He was your voice for this dude. <laughs> I'll do it again. This is Walter Fox, CDN Global News. It has been more than two months since the first of these giant monsters appeared, wrecking hot across the globe. As the United Defense Forces have struggled to respond to these so-called xenotypes, we are left with a host of questions. What are these monsters? Where did they come from? And who is going to stop them? Well, tonight, the CDN exclusive, one of these questions will be answered. We're coming to you live from the evacuated city streets of Tokyo, and it appears that a mech that has yet to be identified is preparing to take on the monsters head on. I almost fucked that up. I think I got it. <laughs> Alright. I also said I like how he <laughs> mentions that before we even get there. I was possible they weren't supposed to be here for no decorate. Decorate? Gatorade? Did I not go far enough? Never mind. I'll just act as I always have and destroy all monsters. Ooh. All right, give me that. How we doing? Eh. Sweet. There we go. Now, if I remember correctly, give me that. Cause why not? How we doing? Ooh. Alright, I'm using all the weapons at my disposal. Oh, sweet, there's a sword. Alright, come on. Come on, we got this. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Don't worry, I want to always suck. Just this episode. Eh. Nah, that's a lie. <laughs> this is the best I'll- This is the best I'll be for a long time. Unless I got a really cool skill. What's that ability? That's a shield. Alright. Alright, you also get a sword. Alright, there we go. Use that energy sword. Eh. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, cool. Mirai is so cool looking. It's sad that he's in the next game. Oh well. There's your no maps, do you copy? Identify yourself, pilot. General Mavis! General Madison Mavis? Madison? I know you're not referring to my grandchild who's still in diapers. Mm-hmm. <laughs> General Maddox Mavis. Star Commander of the UDF Ground Forces. That was some present work you did there. Not too many people could take on that many Z types at once. How would you like a job? Maddox Mavis, of course. I am in the right time period. None of this makes sense, though. We are in for the fire of our life, soldier, and I think you have the time to make a real difference. I'm not asking you to make any sense of this. I just wanted to remind those damn monsters who the most dangerous species on the planet is. Do we have a deal? <laughs> Why does this guy just look at me like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> There's no path forward. If I had scholars of Rob <laughs> to the rapid response team. <laughs> He's just looking at me like I'm crazy. Ah. <laughs> uh. You're cute. I'm gonna pet your face now. 10% of damage taken is reflected back to the enemy. Ooh. I mean, I've got any other ability, so I'm gonna take it regardless. Cosmetic unlocked. Shifu Moss. Ooh. That's pretty cool. I don't use this cash in this game, by the way. I like unlocking things naturally. I might use this cash every now and then, but nah. Mostly not. I wanna unlock things myself. 
The Mech Valley is headquarters. Wow, seeing in one piece certainly brings back memories. Here in the military base now, soldier, there's nothing faster than the League's low orbit command center. For rapid mech deployment around the globe. This hunk of junk will finally do the <laughs> do some real good in the world. Yes, there's still time to bring safety and hope to the people. You will bring sweet death from above! We're attempting to triangle the location of the main horde as we speak. <laughs> but I'll take around 10 days of pinpoint exact location. He's still looking at me. <laughs> and this is in the meantime, I'll search for answers. That's a fast soldier. There's smaller herds of Zeotimes attacking cities all around, the, all around the globe. The enemy doesn't look for answers, so neither will we. <laughs> we won't look for weaknesses. We must fight. Spoken like true Magus. Okay, where am I needed? We'll put, the la we'll put up the latest distress signals. Respond as many as you can. Yeah, alright, cool. Ooh. Very easy. Very easy. This one has less days. So, that means I can last for longer and get more rewards from it. Alright, alright. There's an upgrade system. There's an upgrade system. I'm not sure where it is, though. Huh. There's a way to upgrade your mech. Where is it? Huh. The world may never know. Alright, what do I want? What do I want? I can go easy. Mexico. Get that research boost. I go to Bhutan. Very easy. It's a little more easier, but it costs more days. Days are valuable for me to get resources. Mm. I go a bit tougher. I go a bit tougher. We'll be fine. We're going to Mexico here. We're going to Mexico. Cool. I want that risk reward kind of situation. Let's do it. Where are they? Uh huh. Plan dropped. Ah, uh, sweet. Alright, dodge. Alright, dodge. You can block as well. I just kind of like dodging more. <laughs> What's this? Oh. I unlocked it. My bad. I already picked it up. Alright. Who else we got? Hi there. How's it going? Have you subscribed yet? Ring that notification bell. Eh. No. Alright. Yeah, okay. No fucking around. Let's do this. Nice, there we go. Alright, let's do this. By the way, that sword doesn't last forever. It'll run out eventually. Show multiple Z doesn't. Oh god, you ambushed me. Alright, let's do this. Eh. Don't worry, I'll be good someday. <laughs> I'll be good this game someday, don't worry. Ah, I made him hit his ally. Alright, cool. Oh god, big boy. Alright. Eh. Wow, that missed. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright, throw. Eh. Eh. Alright, cool. Where is it? Ah. Uh, you want to destroy xenotype nests. Those spawn more xenotypes. Basically endlessly. Alright. This is one of the best skills to kill xenotype nests pretty quickly. I was going to use this thing as a shield. 
<laughs> I'm using the way it blocks my it blocks his attacks. Why not? Alright, cool. There we go. Nice. Nice, nice. Where's the next enemies? Woo! Alright, we got a big boy here. He's a power attack. There we go. Nice. There we go. There we go. Anyone else? No. Oh, I'm going to need that upgrade screen. I'm going to need it. Alright. Research boost. Sweet. Give me that sweet, sweet research boost. The higher the difficulty, the more rewards you get, by the way. So yeah, I wouldn't have gotten as much if I went to Bhutan. Start this yellow. Cool. Alright. There's not always skins, you sometimes you get accessories, like hats. So that's pretty cool. How I'm going to do is I'm going to be one boss. Probably like you to introduce your lead research to our new research lead, Dr. Fujiwara. She's transferred here from the R&D department to help our mechs from the around the globe combat ready. Doctor like says, you're not around here, are you? That is an astute observation, Doctor. No. <laughs> I'm from... Canada. That's not what I meant. I think you know it. Tell me, how'd you make the jump? Huh, oh, perhaps the two we can talk about this at a more appropriate time, Dr. Fujiwara. Sigh, no deep such a grouch. Such a grouch, sir. Was there anything else, Doctor? No, sir. Good. As I was saying, Yoshio, if you're ever looking for upgrades, go see Dr. Fujiwara in the mech. Oh, there it is. She'll help you out. Just remember, the better you perform, the more resources you'll receive for upgrades. With all the new mechs that have joined the fight recently, this seems to be the best way to allocate resources. See you the next mission when ready. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I want. Alright, what do I want to upgrade? Heat capacity. Alright, let's put upgrades in all of them. That's how I like to do it. Make ourselves strong. Let's increase heat capacity. There we go. Cool. Alright, what do we got? We got a weapon pack. They're all four days. They're all four days. Huh. I don't really feel the need for a weapon pack, so... Let's go for that research boost. Let's keep getting that money for upgrades. Alright. How I'm going to do this is I'm going to do all these until we get to next boss. There's, um, three, four bosses in total. So, yeah. I'll be doing those. Alright. Here we are. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Oh god. Hi. How's it going? Kings do a lot of damage, I feel like. Charge at me. Nice! There we go. Oh, I don't like these. These do a lot of damage. They're not the toughest things in the world, but they're fast and they hit hard. They hit pretty hard. Alright. Keep hitting them. Keep knocking them down. We got this. Ooh. Alright. I think I'm actually going to use a power move here. Ah, shit, nest. Alright, it's spawning these guys, though. These guys I'm not that worried about. I mean, what the fuck can they do? You know what I mean? Especially with this. Especially with this. I just kind of hide behind here. And then they would just use it as a bullet shield. Sweet. Alright, keep going. Alright, lock this one down next. Alright, cool. Hi. Alright, where's the next dude? Oh, there's some swords. Give me those. Nice, nice. 
Mirror is so cool. So sad that he's on the next game. It makes sense from the story perspective, though. You'll see what I mean. Nope. Ow. Those guys do AoE. Dodge. Oh god. Dodge. Oh, this guy's tougher than the others. Alright. Let's do this. Mm. God, these guys hit like trucks. It doesn't help that we're running out of heat constantly as well. <laughs> it really doesn't. Alright, there we go. Nice! Those upgrades did some good. Those upgrades did some good. We only keep focusing on those. If I get a mod along the way, that's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. Alright, 300. Sweet. Cosmetic unlocked. Alright. Cool. Washbot pink. Of course. Of course. Saving or returning to HQ. Sweet. Alright. Alright. We only got three days left. Bhutan. Research boost. Very easy. I mean, it's fairly obvious. Weapons are cool enough. Weapons are cool. But I want to do research boost. Boost up them stats. Speaking of stats, what do I want? I feel like that's fine. So, we'll work on um, basic attack strength and armor. We do got enough for one more. Um, increases the charge rate of special, of the specials meter, increases the damage of special attacks, or increases movement speed. Movement speed could be useful because I could dodge more easy. So. We'll go for that for now. Alright, we'll go to Bhutan. And soon we're going to be at our first boss. It's pretty cool. And then we'll end the episode. After we beat that. So of course. These maps are pretty cool. I mean, just look at these. Oh god. Where is it? I can't see it. Where is it? Oh. There it is. Hi. You are a big boy, aren't you? There's a mode called Xeno Swarm. And, uh, over at 2, so... I have to be curious, are these going to return? We haven't really seen any gameplay or proof... Image proof that they will. Although it would be pretty cool if they did. Alright, who is it? I don't care about you. I don't care about them as much. Any real threats? No. Alright, fine. Oh, there's a real threat. Alright, dodge. Dodge. Yeah, just do this. There we go. Alright. Yeah, okay. Get the swords. Dual sword wielding. Alright, there. They're over there. Here's one of them. Ow. That also stuns you. That also stuns you. Just a thing to note. Just fire them. There we go. All right. All right, come on. We got this. Lock his ass down. Beat him up. Ow. Just ow. All right. How's it going? Is your name PewDiePie? 
How's it going, bros? How's it going? Alright. Still got a good hit on it. No. Hit her too. Hit her miss. I guess I never miss. Nope. 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 How's it going? Oh, you're a big boy. You're a big boy. I'll focus on you first. I use my ability on you. There we go. Cool. Alright. We got it. Fairly easy, to be honest. Mission complete. Give me that research boost. Nice. 270. That's as much as I would have liked, but you know, it's fine. Maestro infected? Ooh. I didn't know I could get the infected like that. Alright, we got a duplicate, though. We got a duplicate. You get extra cash for duplicates. I thought you could only infect. Unlock the infected through um being the game with them. Which that is the way you can unlock them. That is the way. Alright, let's do this. <clears throat> Sorry. Power the mission coming through, pilot. We pinpoint the locations of the horde. Head to these coordinates immediately. I'll explain on the way. Alright. Uh, maybe someone likes my stupid accent. Maybe someone. Alright, what do we want? What do we want? Increase your heat capacity. That could be useful. Um, ooh. Let's increase the armor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so our first story mission. After this, we'll end the episode. Alright, let's do this, though. Let's do the boss. There's a boss here, by the way. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Alright, Russia. Cool. I'll try to show off every map. That'd be pretty cool. I'll try. Alright, lesson up, Yoshio. You're heading towards one of our highly classified testing facilities in the undisclosed location, Siberia. Right. We have a prototype mech being developed here. Watchbot 2 point is what we're calling it. You must protect that at all costs. Now remember, you are not to mention anything about this facility or what you've seen today outside of our unit. You were never here. Bam bam me, I'd prefer to keep a low profile myself. Stop looking at me! I'm trying to do YouTube. I'm not crazy. Not yet. Is that the mech? It looks like a cheap rip off of me. What mech soldier? I don't want to see a secret military grade prototype mech. Do you? Alright, I'll play along. Excellent. Now go protect that mech. Hoo-wah! What well, this basically is, is good version versus bad. Can, can you target the one that's closest to me? Thank you. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Cool. Good work out there. You su out there? Good work out there. You succeeded in your first major mission to prototype those endangerment line beyond repair. Now, that was a mission. That was the most easiest mission. That was more easier than the first mission. Had I been there, there wouldn't have been any damages. And there wouldn't have been any repairs to worry about. Ah, this bitch. I walk him back, Satesh. He should have never sent me on that air in general. It should be me. Mine, mine, mine. Nonsense, you're one of our best pilots. You're much more valuable in the field than guarding this facility. Besides, no one could have known the horror was going to crop up here. Yeah, classic Satesh. Do we know each other? Identify yourself. Reveal thyself. Huh, no, of course not. But everyone knows you. Always ready for battle. Classic Satesh. Look, I don't work with fans. It's life or death out here. There's no room for distractions. Dimension is my only focus. I'm a zero. Trust me, I'm the fan. Yeah, I don't think anyone does. Maybe at the mech, but she's a dick. You still haven't identified yourself. 
Are you going to tell me who you are? Or am I going to have to beat it out of you? I said classic Satesh. Fun fact, Satesh's campaign is the only one that's somewhat different. I mean, they have different audio, right? They have different dialogue, depending on which character you're playing. It's obviously different gameplay. But Satesh's is the only one that actually changes. Because I'm obviously you're playing as Satesh. So then your enemy turns to watch bot. The rival you encounter in the other places. I'm not playing as Satesh, by the way. I'm not playing as Mirai. <laughs> I don't want to deal with her for the whole campaign, so I'm good. Well, that's certainly different. I bet it bleeds all the same, though. Move in! If it bleeds, it can die. Damn it, they're everywhere. I'll take care of that, General. It's for you, Mr. Man. The big guy's all yours, but this isn't over. <laughs> yes, you take out the big buff one. The one that looks like it's going to kick both of our asses. I'll deal with the small, weak, frail ones. Yeah, good job. Good job with that. Good job with that. Where is it? Where is it? Teleport. Oh god. It's over there. Oh god. That's right. I'm holding a shield. Eh. I was like, why am I not doing any damage? That's why. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Dodge. Get out the way. Ow, 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 ow. Alright, let me do this. Eh. Alright, come on. We got this. Woo! Alright, come on. Keep at him, keep at him. He's over there. Alright. This guy is pretty tough on hard. He isn't that tough on, the, on normal like at all. But on hard, he's, he's a different story. Ow. Oh god, I'm losing. I'm losing pretty bad here. Alright, come on. We got this. Ow. Alright. Ultimate power. Alright, let's do this. Nice! Is he dead? How are you not dead? <laughs> this is how. Okay, there we go. <laughs> wow, he kicked my ass. Luckily, the ultimates are a thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there we go. <laughs> wow, I saw a damage tick. That new Xenotop wasn't... It wasn't just different than the rest of them. It was in the class of its own. Alright. Now, need to worry, Doctor. There's nothing that can't be solved with a good old-fashioned beatdown. For now, for now, at least. But we better keep an eye on this. Yeah, yeah. I'd say. Alright, cool. Mod slot unlocked. What's this? You can install three mods at once. New mod unlocked. Sweet. Was it? Was it? Heal 35% of melee damage done. Ooh. I'm getting a lot of melee ones. 10% of damage taken is reflected back at the enemy and now heal for 25% of melee damage done. That's fancy. That's real fancy. And we all have the cosmetic. Watch bot. Office bot. Legendary. Ooh. I mean, it's a duplicate. I already have it. So, I got a lot of cash, but still pretty cool. I guess. Yeah. Alright. Let's go ahead and finish up their dialogue and then. That's it for this episode. Watch about 2.0. So. It's. So. 
Watch my 2.0 self. Watch my 2.0 is safe thanks to you, Yoshio. We're going to have to relocate it to another facility, though. We can't risk another random attack like that. There's too much riding on this prototype. All right. All right. So, these are it. Cool. Oh, we didn't get it. That's right, we didn't get any cash for that. We're still broke. All right. All right, cool. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. If you guys enjoyed, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And yeah. Next time, we're going to be making it to the um, second boss battle. Second and third, technically. Because there's two, one after another. Fun fact. But yeah, we're going ahead and do that next episode. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Or else channel. I hit where I said that. Be sure to share the video, though. I didn't say that. Now, yeah, I'll see you in the next episode. Pretty cool. I didn't really show it. I think I'm going ahead and add this back in as a little bonus clip. Stardust, right? What do we get? Yellow. Yellow looks pretty ugly, ain't it? No, it's actually pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Alright, cool. I got something for a watch button, didn't I? I think I did. That was something. We got something. Either way, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright, yeah. Just, just a little bonus clip.